Denver metro area is like a brunch area, right? 5280 Magazine helping you map out the best places to check out. Here with us this morning is the assistant food editor, Rianne Mandardi Morrison. Thanks for coming in. Thanks so much for having me. So brunch, my goodness, so many choices, so little time. So how did you guys uh, pick what brunch you featured? Yeah, so my colleague and I eat at so many places and we uh, explore all around town and choose some of our favorite brunch spots. So we've rounded up um, over 50 spots that we we really love um, between some of the best in town, places to get great buffets, places to eat international flavors, um, and so much more. And you talked about brunch on, on, uh, on a budget too, right? You don't brunch have to break the bank to go to brunch. Exactly, yeah. There's, there's brunch for every budget. There's buffets that cost $75 per person, something, you know, much, much more attainable, $15, $20 per person. You can eat excellent brunch. All right, so you had some chefs make up some stuff for you this morning, and uh, what'd you bring in? Yes, absolutely. So. Um, we have from Hira Patisserie um, here. This is Ethiopian food. So if you're interested in mm -hmm. something a little spicy, something a little different, um, we have Awaze Tibs, which is a stewed beef uh, dish, very spicy, um, along with uh, Chichebsa, which is uh, flatbread spiced with Berber spices and honey, served with injera, which is a, a spongy flatbread. Um, and also from Hira Patisserie, we have um, something called Fool, which is fava beans that are mashed and served with feta cheese, eggs, and a wheat roll, um, a little bit spicy, not too spicy, uh, very approachable. Right. We also sweets. I mean, uh, who, who doesn't brunch is love, all about sweets, right? Who doesn't love uh, French toast? I mean, these are from our friends at Catavella. This is a stuffed French toast with a raspberry cream cheese. Uh, you can also get it with a Nutella or a cinnamon <laughs> cream cheese. So good. Oh, my goodness. And then uh, real quickly, these last two here, what'd you bring? Yes, this is from uh, Nest Cafe at Nurture, a uh, wellness marketplace. And we have on top here, we have a um, salmon tartine. Mm -hmm. um, it has some capers, some house uh, yogurt, labna. Um, and it's just wonderful on uh, reunion sourdough, so good. Um, and then below we have a, um, a strata. Um, and actually this strata, I'm sorry, the strata is also from Catavella. It's a layered, um, a layered custard and bread, um, almost like a well, quiche. It all looks delicious. We'll, we'll maybe taste a little bit of it a little later here. So good. Um, yeah, so do you have a favorite place that you go to brunch? Yeah, so it depends what you're looking for. So uh, one of my favorites uh, that's quirky is Baba and Pop's pierogi, where you can get a 50 ounce Buddy Mary that comes with pierogies, <laughs> cheese. Um, it comes with a sausage, bacon, everything you could want. Okay. Super and fun. and really, I mean, it's it's all about brunch in Denver. So a lot of these places get really busy, right? Very busy, yes. So if you can make a reservation, uh, I recommend to make a reservation mm -hmm. for your for your group. Um, otherwise, there are a bunch of places that will uh, accept walk-ins. So yeah. get there early and try to beat the crowds. Patio, non-patio, I mean, uh, booze, non-booze. I mean, there's all sorts of choices out there. Absolutely, yep. And uh, this edition comes out when? Um, so it's out online, so okay. we are, um, we rounded up all the best content online and we are getting ready for our brunch event, which is May 21st oh, okay. at the Jacquard Hotel um, in Cherry Creek. And uh, all the stuff that you see here will be available from the amazing chefs and restaurants um, who will be uh, joining us that day. And tickets are now available at 5280.com. Oh, that is going to be an event. All right. Sounds yeah. good. Thanks for coming in. Thanks for bringing breakfast. Thank you. Yes. Appreciate Enjoy. It. All right, Ed.